Hello everyone, welcome to our channel for Model T Camp and Adventures and it's about time the weather has changed it's starting to look a whole lot nicer so it's time to start getting the Model T out getting it ready for the year where we'll be headed to more expo coming up here in about a month from when I'm filming this and we're going to be taking the Model T this year and setting up a more expo it's going to be a little different than what we're used to doing because we've never had to set up on concrete before and we'll be inside the building so I've had to make a few wooden frameworks and stuff to attach the tent to but we're just going to go set up as a display this year we won't be able to take the, the car out and run any trails because we'll be inside the building won't be able to get the car out but it'll be a new experience for us and we're hoping to see everybody at more and so for today we're just getting most of the camping stuff back into the model d and getting uh, the car serviced and it's been in storage most of the winter we don't get to drive it a lot in the winter because there's no heater and it does get cold here in the hills of arkansas so Today is just getting the car out, getting it running again. Probably take it out for a short drive today. She hasn't started in probably a couple of months. So we're gonna see how lucky we are here today. First thing is get the transmission in neutral. Make sure the parking brake is set. <clears throat> this is the choke. Turn the key on. Make sure my spark advance is all the way up. Give it a little bit of gas. Choke it. A little bit of spark. cold nature trying to fire up but it's been a couple of months
thinks it's cold. She's got the lap robe out. One of the best burgers in this part of the country. Shrimp fish dinners. Yep, fish dinners, shrimp dinners. It disrupts my skin with itch. It disrupts my skin with rash. But now, hello. Pretty good. That's a bird. It's in Scotland, Arkansas. I think somebody's got Model T hair. Mm -hmm. Okay, we made it back from going to the gas station. And then we went by the car wash, washed the car off a little bit because being inside at Moore Expo, I figured it needed to be clean. This wooden framework is going to be where our tent will attach to. It's the only way I could figure out how to put a tent up on concrete. But after we got back from the gas station, I got out here and we're pretty much loaded now to go camping. So if we wanted to go, we're fully loaded. Got the gas cans, water cans on it. <clears throat> this is the tent poles and the tripod for our Dutch oven cooking that we do. The car is pretty much fully loaded. The only thing missing would be our drinking water and food we have to take our clothes and then we don't have our blankets and pillows in there yet but pretty much everything else is in there time you get the blankets and pillows in it fills it pretty much all the way to the top of the roof but that stuff doesn't weigh nothing
see if it'll start. Free start. When they're running right, they'll free start without having to crank them. That's about as good as it gets.